Eddie, we're here for the big one at the SSC Arena Wembley, a huge show to close out. What's been a tough and uncertain UK year? Just talk us through how excited you are. You're nervous. Anthony Joshua defended his world heavyweight title tonight. Yeah, I mean, what a way to finish the year. It's been tough, but I think everyone's done a great job at Matchroom and Sky Sports, the zone, to, to keep the momentum of boxing. There's nothing quite like an Anthony Joshua fight night, you know, regardless. The hype, you know, you open the papers today, every paper, back page, double page spread on, on the champ. Tough fight. You know, I'm nervous. I think AJ's nervous, the team are nervous, and, and that's good because you know you're in a real fight and you know you're going to be switched on. Amazing to see a 1,000 people back here tonight. What a view they've got, you know, just in the lower central tiers. Um, just got to get the win. Got to get the win. I expect a, a fascinating night of boxing and I expect a thrilling main event, as always, with Anthony Joshua. He bounced back, of course, from the defeat at MSG with a, a masterclass out in Saudi against Andy Ruiz. Just how dangerous is Kubrat Pulev? Really dangerous because he's a top 10 heavyweight, probably a top five heavyweight. He's the mandatory challenger, very experienced. Um, one defeat to Vladimir Klitschko. And, you know, all these fighters, they raise their game when they fight AJ. All of a sudden, you see him turn up 10 pound lighter. You know, all of a sudden, he's got a six pack from nowhere because this is their golden chance to beat Anthony Joshua. You know, he talked about his father had a dream for his son to, to become the world heavyweight champion. Tonight, he's one punch away from realizing that dream. So it's always dangerous in the division. Pulev's a world-class fighter, but I believe you're going to see a fantastic performance from Anthony Joshua. When Anthony's been asked about it, all talk from his perspective about that potential fight with Tyson Fury has been very much on hold. In your opinion, if he gets through tonight, do we see that fight in 2021? I believe so, but you've got to get through tonight. You know, this is uh, one of the most dangerous fights of AJ's career for many different reasons, um, but we need a great performance tonight, and then we can move on and start talking about fights after tonight. But for tonight... It's all about Anthony Joshua trying to defeat Kubrat Pulev and holding on to his world championship belts. Just talking us through the rest of the card. A big night of boxing on Sky Sports Box Office, box office and Design for the fans to look forward to. Tonight. Yeah, I mean, Kez Ashfak kicks us off on Facebook. Then we've got a great little fight with Florian Marku and Jamie Stewart, both undefeated, both tough as nails. And then you've got Kieran Conway and Macaulay McGowan, who's been a real character in the bubble this week, kicking off left, right and centre. And then for me, one of the fights of the night, Sergei Kuzman against Martin Bacoli. Big, big heavyweight fight, very important for the division. And Huey Fury, I think, must make a statement against a very, very motivated Marius Wack, who's here with a big team and here to win. Lawrence Acoli against Jazuski must win to keep his world championship uh, hopes alive. And then, of course, on to the big one. It's an absolute packed night of boxing. I think we're going to get loads of entertainment, loads of drama, and we pray for a win. You touched on it earlier as well. It's a bit of an end of an era in some ways, especially for the here at the, the being over at the Hilton, the Wembley residency. It's going to be great to have the fans back, but a strange end and a great end for, for what's been a very uncertain time. Yeah, I think um, we don't know if it's the end, do we? I mean, it could be the end, could be the same old next year, but we've covered all bases. We've done a great job. It's been fantastic here at the SSE Arena, Hilton over the road. The bubble's been great fun. Do we see a bubble again, don't we? We worry about that tomorrow because tonight it's all about AJ against Pulev. Eddie, thanks for your time. Cheers. Brilliant.